What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today we're going to try to do something different. The shorts, life hacks, survival life hacks been out of control. People are getting like hundreds of millions of views. So I found one very interested. They have done something similar. It is a uh, AAA batteries, like I've done it 10 years ago and a um, uh, bubble gum rub, but they have it kind of improved it. So let's try it out, see if it's going to work. This life hack right here, it's something I've done similar with the bubble gum wrapper, got over 12, 14 million views, so that's insane. Let's see if it actually works. That looks so interesting. There's a channel. For this experiment, we're going to need a battery, a wire, multi-tool, and of course, a char cloth. That's what I saw in the video. Let's go. Let's see if the charging wire will work. I have too many of them every time they give me a gadget. They give you a little charger, so they everywhere. So it looks like there's two wires within a wire. Might be a bit easier to cut it this way. Stape one section of it, looking good. Now we have a lot of fibers here. They were using scissors, so we can find it here. I'm gonna cut off extra insulation. Okay. That, that looks good to me. Then I'm going to leave out one of them and cut this off very fragile so be careful with that then we need chalk cloth i have videos on it how to make it i might make more videos about it and then all we need is a small piece so i really like that scissors take off a piece it's pretty brittle i could just rip it off too then we're going to roll it. I don't know. Looks good to me. I think it'll be okay. Maybe a bit smaller. What he did is just roll it around a few times. So supposedly it's going to heat up and get a charcoal on fire. It should be no problem. Will it work with the AA battery? If not, 9 volt battery. Okay guys, there goes nothing. I'll touch it right here. And touch it right here and let's see let's see if it'll do anything ah it's actually getting my hands are a little bit hot it's definitely making my hands hot but is it doing anything oh i see a little smoke no way it's actually working no way that is working so what I will do is get a bit more chalk cloth now that it's working and put it in a bigger piece so that I don't lose it. Okay. Look how hot that is. I have some shavings over here. Let's see if it'll work. Look how hot the chow cloth is. That is incredible. I need more glass, it's all wet right now. But it definitely works so good. I thought the wire would burn off, but no, it didn't. So we could reuse it one more time in case we failed. So I'm gonna rope it around again on a smaller piece. That looks so cool. And once again, grab one end and the other end and just hold down like this and it will burn it and it'll get hot. Let's see what happens. Oh, I see it's getting really, really hot right here. Ooh, it's steaming and it's now it's hot, hot. Okay, now I'm gonna get another little piece of chalk cloth. And all I have to do is just touch it. And get it hot. Chow cloth is awesome. Okay, this time I'm gonna get a napkin.
Ooh, I pass out blowing so hard. Man, fail again, but you see it's possible. Oh, I'm gonna pass out. It's still going to be pretty hot, so I'm gonna put it in the other one. I really thought they would do it with a napkin. Get some candling going and set it on fire. Let me get something better. Uh, toilet paper a bit thinner, so I'll put the chalk cloth. So it's really, really hot. I don't know why it doesn't want to start with toilet paper. Usually it's so easy to start toilet paper on fire. <coughs> you lost it again. Okay, let's do this one last time. Chalk cloth and kind of like a cotton ball thing. And will it work for the third time with this little wire? I think it will. See if it'll get hot enough. This is such a cool idea. I really enjoying this idea. Okay, time to improve it. Ah, wear glass when you do this. Ah. Okay, I see it's getting hot. Yeah, I see it's smoking. Okay, at first it's kind of hot on my finger, smoking a lot. Okay, that's gotta be it. Take the wire out. Oh, it finally broke off the wire. Now this should be no problem to light up. Oh, and we finally got the fire going. There you go. Boom. Big moist day today, usually it would be a lot easier with dry glass. Okay guys, that's pretty much it. Creativity wise, an amazing life hack. Let's talk about the likelihood of having a battery and a charger wire. It's pretty likelihood, pretty good one because you probably have a flashlight and um, um, maybe have batteries inside of them. Any kind of like uh, gaming systems that kids have, toys, whatever, they could be in a car. Uh, batteries, the AA battery, most common batteries, and yeah, wire charger always in the car in most people cars, and yeah, I love the idea. the The only thing is um, the chalk cloth. You might not have it, so in that sense, chances are you're not gonna be able to do it. Uh, to make chalk cloth, you'll need a container like that and cloth and make a chalk cloth. So I'll try to do it in the future with a different kind of uh, wire without chalk cloth fire starter but with the wire and a battery but chalk cloth will be hard to get it's not a really common uh, piece of um, like you know equipment in your car so you would still have to pair up some of the fire starting with you